What is up? This is Andrew. I uh, just wanted to make a quick video to show you guys how to use your CCB account or your church community builder account. You want to go to our church website, click on the members tab, and then go to login, which will send you to CCB to log into your account. If you don't have a login or a password yet, I can help you figure that out. You're going to click login once you plug in your info. Then you're going to see on the right, you're going to see a bunch of different groups that you can be a part of. You click on Anchor Middle School Leadership. And so this is pretty cool. Um, it'll probably actually open to this page for you guys. Um, I'm going to start using this more to message you guys. I'm going to start using it more for events, like I've used it in the past for our leaders meetings um, to have you RSVP. And so uh, there's actually this cool feature that I want to start using that allows me to schedule who's going to be at different services. So what you're going to want to do is tell me when you can serve by clicking on the Serb tab on the left, um, which is going to be over here on the left. Click Serve. Then you're going to need to tell me your availability to serve by marking out it out on the calendar for me. So it'll bring up this thing so you can block out dates by simply clicking on the date that you're unavailable. So you're unavailable for next weekend. You just click that, and then you can't be scheduled for that time. Then I need you to do this preference things. If you're always up for being scheduled, you can do that. Or if you have a preference for when you want to be scheduled, like maybe you want to be only scheduled... Um, you know, certain m amount of times per month for the weekend services. So maybe you say two weeks per month I'm up for serving. Um, maybe you want specific weeks like the first, the third, and the fifth week. I will help in whatever capacity for the weekend services. Or maybe you just want to do some other combination of the of that. It's pretty awesome to just be able to tell me how often you're available to help serve and then I can schedule you guys, and um, it really helps me. I've already done it for myself to put my own vacation time in there, and it just tells me and anybody else that I'm blocked out for those dates and cannot be scheduled for them, which is an awesome feature. super helps me know that we have enough people to help with all the different positions and needs that we have for the service. You can click on Find a Replacement if you're ever... Um, you know, schedule for something and you can't do it. Um, there's also ability to email me. You can email me directly through this to, um, you know, just tell me what's going on or connect with me about if you need different, you know, schedule. Um, this is what's going to look like from my perspective for each week. Um, I've already kind of messed with it a little bit and put myself in there. Um, you know, I'll be able to look at the schedule. Um, and say, okay, sweet, we need more people for Welcome Desk, we need more people for Youth Leaders, and I can go in here and schedule you guys by name, um, you know, where there's just missing spots. Um, you know, I've already kind of gone through Planning Center and put in Dakota and Craig in the different spots that I know you already will be here, so I figured you'd be upstairs to help out. Um, and I just s will be sending you guys these requests um, you know, on a weekly basis, on a monthly basis, just to say, hey, can you help me out on this day? And if you give me your availability, then there won't be any confusion, and you'll just be getting an email in your email box that 